Okay, in this video I'll show you the installation of uh, Zimbra appliance in VMware Workstation. As you know, you can download the OVF version of uh, Zimbra appliance or you can download the VMX version. The setup is slightly different in the VMX version. So after the downloading to your hard drive, you uncompress, you find the VMX file, you execute it, open it in the VMware workstation power on the VM you keep the defaults, you don't have to adjust the memory or something when it's come up you first have to accept the license agreement you just have to scroll down keeping the enter key and uh, write yes ok here we go so now the setup continues uh, generating the SSH host keys etc The appliance um, gonna take uh, the IP address from your DHCP server on your network. So you have to have a DHCP server because when it first come up, it's uh, taking the address from the DHCP. But you can change it later on, of course. Huh? take some time yeah the default user is called VMware so you set up a password for him and you're done so you see the IP address followed by the port number 5480 so you fire on your web browser and via HTTPS uh, you connect to the IP address there is a 2.5480 ok so now you type in the VMware user and the password and you can personalize your Zimbra appliance. Uh, you put in your admin email address. Here I just fill in my secondary domain, what I have. Uh, I'm not using it. Um, apply that, and basically you're done. Well, now it's gonna take some time because the appliance gets set up, all the services uh, are starting, the installation continues. So, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna pause the video and I'll be back when it's finished. so here we can see on the network I already changed for the fixed IP address and uh, you can do it over here you can create new accounts you have the 
different settings you can see the license you can install a new license file new license from another license file uh, okay 